when you start reading geology textbooks or reading papers and there's a photograph of a geological outcrop, it will invariably have something in there, oftentimes a rock pick. If it's larger, there'll be a person standing there. It could be the, the geologist's cap. Anything to give you a sense of scale because so many of the features and formations of geology are scale invariant. You might be looking at a photograph and you're going, okay, is this six feet high or 600 feet high? And you can't tell. Why? Because the scale is invariant. So it doesn't change regardless of the, the size of what you're looking at. Pythagoras said, you will know as far as it is allowed to a mortal that nature is from all points of view similar to itself. Then you had Lucretius who was a Roman poet and philosopher, he wrote this, So far as it goes, a small thing may give analogy of great things and show the tracks of knowledge. In other words, if you're trying to understand great phenomena, which is beyond your conceptual framework because of its vast scale, well, the idea here is that because of this scale invariant nature of manifest reality, you can look at small things, and that will give you insight into the relations amongst much greater things. And thusly, you may, as it says, show the tracks of knowledge. 